Hi guys, what's going on? And welcome back to another episode of Total War Arena. So today I am going to have a go at learning how to use the hoplites. So uh, I've basically never used hoplites or, or have very limited use of them uh, through closed beta. And I've not really used them at all yet in open beta. But I, I got up through through the tech tree, I headed up the Carthaginian uh, sword infantry. I'm up to tier 5 and soon to be on to tier 6. But uh, by doing that, I got access to the tier 4 Carthaginian hoplites. And I thought, well, it would be interesting to give them a go. I often face off against hoplites. You know, they can be quite effective when used properly. So I think it's something I should try and learn. So we're going to have a go at this game and see how it goes. For some reason, just to make it that little bit harder, I decided let's record this one live rather than using a replay. So I'm probably going to look like an utter moron by the end of this video. But let's see how we get on. Um, I am not even fully upgraded. Got the shield and the helmet. I don't know why I've got the helmet. Oh, because I went down the cavalry tree, so that's why I got, got the helmet. Um, so we're still missing the spear and the Bexter body armor. But I, I, I think you know, it doesn't matter. We've got consumables. I'm running the Anabas An Anatha Blessing because it increased melee attack and defense. So let's hop into queue up a game and basically let's see how we get on. Uh, it could be interesting, um, or it could all go terribly. Um, I'll skip to the battle in the second. Uh, one thing I wanted to quickly ask is. Um, so I'm trying to sort of keep a, a video a day uh, on my channel and at the moment that's particularly obviously with the Total War Arena videos particularly since we've gone to open beta and um, I really enjoy making the arena videos and obviously it's doing quite well for the channel as well which is always helps um, but to that end trying to make a video a day on something new is quite hard <laughs> and to actually grind through to the next level on all the units to actually get new things to play um, so if anyone has got any like really good battle replays maybe um, a game where you got 10,000 points, you know, or 6,000 aggression damage, or I don't know, just had a really exciting game. Um, maybe we could start doing some submitted replays or something like that, uh, and we could do like Battle of the Week or um, something like that. I, I don't know, that's just a thought. I know a lot of some of the other channels, particularly like World of Tanks channels that I used to watch, used to do uh, other people's submitted replays, and that used to be pretty fun. So maybe that would be something that would be quite cool to do. So if you've got anything you want to submit, any replays, anything like that, um, you can drop me a comment in the channel or um, I think if you go to my about page I think it should have my email on there you can click through so send me an email maybe with a replay on that would be absolutely awesome um, but that aside let's see how we get on with the hoplites today um, where am I gonna go That's the first question let's go over here um, yeah so probably could charge up block this passage it looks like we're against other tier 4s there's no tier 5s so we've not got any elephants or anything to worry about so, some archers and oh, we did have some archers. They've gone. Take the enemy base. So let's move up relatively hard. I think uh, from the off, let's get force march activated. Should give us quite a good base speed. Yeah, four point four five is pretty decent. Um, and get these guys up to this passageway here. Yeah. So my knowledge of pikemen. Um, Oh, well, they actually have raised shields. That's kind of cool. Um, extends to the fact that, that, yeah, once you form up, you're basically trying to manage fatigue once you're in a hoplite formation. And I think advancing forwards, pushing into the enemy, increases fatigue, but stepping backwards uh, regenerates your fatigue. So it sort of seems to be a bit of a balancing act of trying to keep that up uh, while fighting your enemies. So there's some Hastati over there. Well, I'm happy to push through um, against them initially. I'm kind of tempted to toggle raid shields in case they're going to throw some peelers at me. But let's just get through this gap first. Um, toggle. Um, I don't know if that protected us that much really. Uh, they now seem to be in full retreat. Let's do, uh, we'll detoggle force march. I shouldn't have had that on. That would have given me uh, a bit of a negative modifier for the missile block chance. Um, do we want to advance into these guys? Some Athenian hoplites, so it's like our direct competition. Let's see if we can advance up enough to capture this uh, point. Oh, there we go. Uh, so that gives us some observation. So there's no enemy archers. Okay, let's push up a little bit further because we might be able to get our javelins uh, forward enough to this gap. We'll detoggle ray shields. Uh, if we can get these, oh, rear flanked by enemy brigands. I am probably going to hold formation. Uh, oh, this is a bit tough. Let's push those guys up there. So I don't want to... Um, uh, it's a bit of a pain. Uh, 
Okay, so let's go into Hoplite. Uh, we're at risk of being rear flanked here, but let's try and hold formation. So let's push into these guys. Uh, so we're both in a thing and we're losing fatigue fairly badly here. So let's watch our fatigue. See, so fierce fatigue is building up. Uh, I'm going to oh, pull back slightly because of a risk of being flanked as it is. So let's pull back. We'll gain a bit of fatigue. These guys are 100 fatigued. So let's pull back slightly here. We've done a lot of damage to these guys already. And we've got our friendly javelins in support. We've also got another unit here which we can use as backup. So let's push into these guys again if they're going to stand there. Okay. Oops, 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 stop. Allies have run in front of me, so we did... Oh, we did 7,000 friendly damage there for, to those allied units. That's not so good. Uh, we've got to re-enter Hoplite in a minute. So, we go back in. Um, I'll let them, these guys try and advance to us. Let's do that. Uh, let's activate determination on both of them. Oh, we got rear flanked again. Uh... Let's try, trying to manage everything is quite hard work. So yes, yeah, so we're losing drastically against these hoplites. Oops, uh, misclicking. Um, so we're sort of, what is going on with you guys? Where are you going? What are you going that way for? Alright, let's you pull back and reform. The levels of fatigue in everyone are very high. Uh, I just want to get these guys back slightly. Try and reform the lines. Uh, these are going to break uh, Hoplite and try and pull back. These guys are still in but have got no fatigue. That's good. I seem to have gone a little bit all over the place here. Um, I'm not sure if we sort of swapped directions. They seem to be now facing off against me. Uh, and they just look like got friendly infantry behind them. So we'll push into these guys again. They obviously have longer spear thrust than us it seems. Because we, we can't damage them in this pipe formation. Despite the fact I'm in Hoplite. Yeah, we completely cannot do any damage to them. And we're rear flanked by cavalry again. I think that is the end of the game for us. It seems we have no support else to support with us. We're really heavily outnumbered here now. So this has not gone very well. And Hannibal is dead. Oh dear. Um, try and at least get some semblance of formation reformed. Um, my map awareness has just been shocking. Let's see if we can just run away, actually. I'm not sure if we are going to be quicker than them or not. They're very quick. And they've got an infantry charge as well. That kind of sucks. Let's try and go back into hoplite formation. See if we can at least get some damage on them. It's really hard because of their longer spears. means it's quite, uh, quite hard for us to deal a lot of damage to them. Reactivate determination on both units. Uh, we're doing a little bit of damage to them, but still not, not a great deal. We're completely surrounded now down to one unit. My uh, my venture into pikemen has not gone particularly well. Uh, only 1,200 aggression damage. It's a pretty poor poor game. Oh dear. Um, so, uh, yes. So I think my few mistakes there, to, if we're going to look at that critically... Um, one shocking uh, situational awareness on my part being the fact I got rear flanked by cavalry about three times and after each time I still never realised and put that spare third unit I had I could have turned him around to face back and just blocked up this gap or at least at least kept uh, observations on where the enemy cavalry was um, so we don't get charged into the rear <laughs> all those times. I also did about 8,000 friendly fire damage by not paying attention to where and my unit was in hoplite and caused damage to the enemy unit and also uh, facing off against those enemy uh, Greek hoplites with the longer spears didn't really do as much favours. They were able to do a lot of damage to us while we couldn't hurt them. Although we did see, particularly when we started to engage the Sestati, we only took about 3,000 damage and managed to deal about uh, sort of 15, 20,000. So when in a proper position against sort of sword infantry or Romans and things like that frontally, they do actually seem to work pretty well. It's just uh, uh, my poor playstyle more that let me down there. Uh, so probably not the most fantastic video. That didn't quite pan out as well as I'd hoped. Um, but then, as I'm sure you're probably all aware by now, I'm not exactly the greatest player in the world, and that is really my first proper attempt at having a go at Hoplites. Um, so I think I'm going to continue playing these. 
uh, sort of over the rest of this evening and the next couple of days to see if I can get a little bit better at them. And hopefully we'll be back with a video of me actually playing them properly. Any tips you've got <laughs> for me for Hoplites, let me know in the comments down below. Really, you could appreciate that. And any good replays for sort of a battle of the week sort of thing. So thanks for watching, guys, and I shall see you all on the next video.